The following demonstrates step-by-step -step instructions for mounting the bolt-on MF51 mounting flange. Although we demonstrate mounting to wood, the procedure is the same for metal or other materials of construction. Step 1. Mark the installation location by using a template of the mounting flange or the mounting flange itself. Step 2. Using a hole saw or suitable equipment, drill center hole to accommodate outside diameter of the VA-51 air sweep. Step 3. Thread mounting flange onto air sweep and insert into hole and vessel wall to confirm air sweep fit through wall and the bolt circle layout. Step 4. Drill the bolt holes. Step 5. Position the gasket and flange over the drilled holes. Loosely insert three bolts from the outside to keep the flange properly aligned. Step 6. Insert remaining bolt from inside of vessel through the remaining flange bolt hole. If access to the inside of the vessel is not practical, Thin flexible wire with strong tape can be used to thread bolts through the large center hole and then into and through the bolt holes. Holding the bolt with fingers, remove the tape and wire and install washer, lock washer and nut. Repeat this step for the remaining three bolts, then firmly tighten all four nuts. Step 7. Measure distance from the inside vessel wall surface to the outside front face of the mounting flange. Step 8. Mark this same distance on the air sweep body, taking care to apply the measurement from the front of the air sweep body, not the front of the air sweep valve head. This mark denotes the limit of the air sweep insertion depth in the mounting to ensure it lines up properly on the inside wall of the vessel when installed. Step 9. Apply thread lubricant to the inside threads of the mounting flange and outside threads on the air sweep body. Step 10. Thread the air sweep into the mounting flange, turning it clockwise until the insertion depth mark is reached. This will position the valve head fully through the vessel wall to allow the air pulse to sweep along the wall when the air sweep is activated. Step 11. Tighten the lock nut to lock the air sweep into its correct installed position. The system installation continues by installing a high flow diaphragm or solenoid valve to the air sweep and compressed gas supply to the solenoid or diaphragm valve.